What's happening YouTube? Phoenix Tiki here, back again today with another episode of PDL, Draft League Battle, single format. We have a good opponent here today, well, eh, well it was Quagsire but it's now Texas Two Cannons I believe the name of the, the team is. As far as I'm aware, I'll get that all sorted out before the, the, the episode goes up. I haven't had a chance to get any content up in the last week so I do apologise about that, we are a wee bit busy, Pokemon Unite coming out, work, university, do you know what I mean, so I might get some Pokemon Unite content up on the, on the YouTube channel, we'll see, if not, well, we'll try and get back to the, the daily daily videos, so I'll be honest, not had much time to prep, <clears throat> this guy's team looks a wee bit scary, so we'll go and see what we're able to do, my issue here being, I haven't a clue on how to win this game. But we'll do our best. It happens sometimes you're busy, life gets in the way. But we'll, we'll see if we can if we can do our best to, to get a wee dub here. So, off the bat, his team looks very scary. Very, very scary. I'm trying to think. So he's got Stealth Rockers and Skarmory. He's got... He's got Skarmory straight off the bat. I think he might go Skarmory straight off the bat. Let's have a look. Confirm. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I think I'll go Talonflame off the bat. I think that's the plan. Get a U-turn out, get a Brave Bird. Hmm. I think we'll go with that. In terms of my team, I feel like Gyarados does really, really well. Once I get rid of Comfy. Comfy. The thing with Comfy is I don't know how he's trained it. So, let's see. Comfy. Straight up there. Okay. Not bad. Cle Cle it was Cle Clefy. Clefy caught me out last week. <laughs> it was steel type. So, we'll see. Go on. See how we do. Part of me thinks that I don't know. I'm not actually hundred percent sure. What I might do is hold on. <clears throat> so finally, we are back. Let's have a wee look at what he sent out. So he leads off with Dunmanitan. So Dunmanitan here is fire type. So my best bet is probably to U turn out into. Gyarados or Gliscor, probably, probably go Gliscor, so he U-turns, which is fine. It's absolutely fine. So I think that's Scarfed on Manitan. Yeah, so Dermanitan Scarfed, which is fine. So this is good here because I can come out into... Come out into Gyarados here. And I don't think he has much that damages me, so your turn. Effective, that's fine. Then a crew comes out. Is he just going to toxic here? So I think he might toxic. Yes, that's okay, that's fine. So here we have double iron bash. Good high horsepower, but then if he reads it, he goes into Landris. But if he goes into Landris, I could maybe get an Ice Punch off. So, uh, reading an Ice Punch would be huge here. I might just Scald though. I'm going to go Ice Punch. Let's go, that's fucking massive. That's absolutely huge. So that, that's his Intimidator cycle, uh, Intimidate cycle completely gone. He's probably going to bring out Dermanitan here. <clears throat> which isn't great for me. I, th I don't know if I can go Gliscor. Just 
Germany is kind of scary in the end game. I think I need to go Glasgow, but I think I don't think I take a hit here. I do. That's fine. He's just going to flare blitz again, which I'm okay with. I think I need to let something, I think I need to sack something here. Um, yeah, I think Glasgow just goes down here. As, 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 as a bad play on my part, I don't think I actually have anything that outspeeds this thing, which is annoying. That's good. That's good, that's really good. Um, he's probably going to bring out Latias here, which is kind of worrying. Latias, I do have ice plans for Latias. Oh, and obviously, Skarmory going to Spikes. Spikes. Um, got a free Rotom switch in here. Good word. Yeah. Good play. Samus. Volt switch off, which is fine. I don't think he has anything here for my mail metal, so I'm just going to have mail metal out. I'm actually unsure whether this is going to be. It's mega ass as well, isn't it? Yeah, that is. What is here? Oh, it doesn't do too much, that's fine. Nice punch, how much? Yeah, we win, we win that, that's good. Unless he crits, if he crits, he might KO. Potentially. Don't know. So is he going to scold here? Do I think he's going to scold? I think he might scold. Yeah, that's fine. We get the berry off. I don't think I really need talent flame here. Go in the mail metal. So it has liberty, so I've got one or two choices here. I think I just high lost power. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. I should have high horse power, 100% should have high horse power. Freeze? No. So he's going to scold. I'm just going to go for the high horsepower. I hope he doesn't get a burn. Good. So that's nice. That's really nice. He's got black sludge, which is fine. Can go out any Rotom here. He's out in the latte ass. That's fine. He's faster than me as well, which is unfortunate. So... Side shot, okay, that's cool. So he's going to go out into Melmetal, pretty much wins this game here. So I think, I think, I think he attacks normally this time. He's done 35, so if he crits, he kills, and if I go, if I go high horsepower expecting the double read again, then... Because he's done it twice in a row, so he might try and catch me out. If I pick up the KO here though, I think I win. So I can sack Talonflame. I mean, I don't really need to sack Talonflame, I guess. So Aura Sphere can also miss, so that, that, that plays a part too, you know. 
Tosi. Thankfully, I'm not streaming as well because this this is um this is a little bit intense. But this play here either makes or breaks the game because if I kill the light ash here, I think I pretty much guaranteed a win. But if I don't and he does go into the the tentacle, we'll see. I could always crit and ice punch too. You know what I mean? So we'll see. Come on, make a move, make a move. The interesting thing as well is I also have a Sashmon in the back. Speed boost. Really nice. How much did Skull actually do me? Only 14%, so even if he hits, he needs to hit the Aura Sphere. Okay, it's fine. That's fine, because I can just... I know. Yeah, I can, I can. Fine, there's no burn. So okay, that's fine. So if he if he brings out Comfy here, yeah. What does he have here? Didn't kiss. Does nothing. Double arm bash. Picks up a kill in one hit. So the thing now here is, what did Orisfield do the first time? Let me see. 36%. So hopefully that's a high roll or he misses. If he picks up a KO, that's absolutely fine. We just bring out Scolipede. We protect. Die Shock, that's absolutely fine. Do a Sash. And then all we do is Bug. Picks up the KO, and that is GG's. So, again, week two. Pick up another win, so we're 2 0, which is a very, very good start. I think the Melmetal is so good. That early that early ice punch read into the, the Landorus switch was huge for me, absolutely huge. That that made a big difference in the, the rest of the game because he didn't intimidate Psycho, he couldn't get that out. The Dermatan kind of scared me a little bit, I sort of made a bad play, I could have maybe played that Dermatan a little bit better. Um. I needed to let him kind of knock his head down a bit so that I could get the one hit kill with Scolipede. Scolipede, Scolipede came in clutch there, like really clutch. I didn't take Scolipede first week, I took Rapid Dash instead for the Como Ovo specifically. But Scolipede was really good here, like really, really good. I also had Sash too, so even if he did get the kill, even if he did hit me there, or he hit me first and I didn't um, protect for the speed boost, it would have been fine because we had Sash, so we'd have, we'd have got a hit off anyway. So I'm actually really, really happy with that game. Um, thanks everybody for watching, thanks everybody for tuning in, if you've got any comments on what I could have done better, probably around the Dermanitan I would surmise, please do drop them down in the comments section below, and if you've got any questions feel free to hit me up, also don't forget to subscribe as well, hit the wee notification bell, um, and I'll try and get the videos out a wee bit more frequently because I know I have been slacking the last week, so I will get them back to pretty much daily, if not bi-daily, so thank you very much everybody, and I'll see you guys next week. Peace.